Hi there. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to select drop down value in your drop down list using Selenium C Sharp. So I'm on this page where the drop down list shows options such as one, two, three, and four, all written in words instead of numbers. So we are going to check ID for this drop down list. Click on inspect element and then select this drop down list so let me select this and it says id is my list notice the camo case here so i'm going to pay attention to that while writing the code now first thing using openqa dot selenium and next class openqa dot selenium dot firefox there is one more class that we need for this program which is Open QA Selenium support UI. You can also include events if you want, but that's not needed. Okay, now next thing create driver instance by typing var driver equals to new Firefox driver. After that, type in driver dot navigate and then go to URL. Okay, now let me copy this URL into this method. After that, let's create one variable name option and let it point to our element by ID. Okay, so by ID, this method should accept our ID my list. Okay. Then I'm going to use one more variable select element pointed to new select element and here I'm going to pass in my variable option so that it okay so this selects our element now the next thing I'm going to add some pods using system dot threading dot thread slip 5000 ms here now the next thing to do is to point out to our element using select element dot select by text so the by text value i want to select here is let's say three okay so make sure that everything is properly managed here no issues with type or so so that it will execute the code okay so now what we did so far we created driver instance then pointed out to element which is for our drop down list then we created select element instance and pointed out our option to select from that drop down then with select element we are selecting the option 3 using select by text you can also use select by index and use 0 1 or 2 to select one of the options from the drop down list finally console.read to pause the output for console errors now click on start button okay, this should open Firefox browser and it will go to our website and then finally it will select option from the list and as you can see it selected three right here okay so the program works you can close window and now you can see this code that you can try for selecting drop down many options.